morning and thank you for joining our Daily Outlook. And today we'll cover the changes in the dollar-yen pair. Greg will be sharing insights from our trading desk. The dollar-yen pair has gained 0.4% in the last session. The stochastic RSI moved sharply into overbought territory. The sterling dollar pair has fallen 0.8% in the last session. The stochastic RSI has collapsed into the oversold zone. The price of gold has lost 0.2% in the last session. The ATR has shifted into the high volatility zone. The price of crude oil has fallen 6.6% in the last two sessions. The MACD plunged into the negative zone. Coming up, today's major financial news. The global pandemic and an unprecedented sucker punch to global growth send Wall Street down another 2%. U.S. oil production will probably take more than two and a half years to return to its record 13 million barrels per day. The New Zealand dollar takes a nosedive owing to an increasingly dovish monetary policy outlook from the RBNZ and exacerbated by the market's latest risk-off mood. And now let's review some of today's world economic events. The German GFK consumer climate will be released at 400 GMT, the U.S. durable goods orders at 1030 GMT, the U.S. GDP at 1030 GMT, the U.S. goods trade balance at 1030 GMT, the U.S. wholesale inventories at 1030 GMT, and the Japanese CPI at 2130 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day.